Thank you for allowing me to see myself the way you see me. Thank you. Hey guys, it's Miss T Lovely, and I'm coming at you with my week 37 post op update. Um, I have to be honest with you guys, this is one of the hardest updates that I'll do because, and I'm already starting off, I'm already tearing up just thinking about everything. Um, I first want to say thank you to all of you guys for your support, um, especially on my last video. I really needed that encouragement. And I still do today, so I need you guys' you know, support. And you guys know that I will. I am returning it, and I will continue to return it. Um, so before I get into this, for those of you who are new to my channel, I want to say welcome and thank you for subscribing. Um, I apologize I haven't been able to come to each of you guys' page individually as I was sick the whole entire week on last week. Um... I want to first acknowledge those of you who are on Facebook. Thank you for your outpour of love for the pictures that I posted. I feel so undeserving of the love that I got, you know, and I say that because of what I'm going through, you know, and I know it's like, Misty Lovely, you know, accept those accolades, but it's so hard when I'm in a, when I've been in a, in a, um, a battle. I've been in the battle with my mind. I'm a day early updated because I wanted to get this out here. I could have waited till tomorrow and hope that the scale would have did something to the flip flop like it always does when I have these times. Um, so let me get right into it here. Last week, I weighed 290, well, two weeks ago, I weighed 290.7. Uh, this week, I weighed 293.3. So that's a 2.6 pound gain. And I know exactly where that gang came from. You know, guys, I'm not one. I mean, have I ever been? No, will I be a person that makes excuses? And I have to put everything out here just as it is and just as I feel it at the moment. Granted, after I get off this camera, after I release myself, God willing, as I did on two weeks ago, I will be released from it. It's just so important to put it out here. It's so important for us to come on here and, and tell the good, the bad, the ugly, what's hurting you, what's making you happy. It's so important. And, and hopefully those who support you and are along with you will appreciate it and will understand and hopefully can relate. Um, I'm almost in tears, you guys. Because looking back nine weeks ago, week 26, I was 75 pounds down. I was on a roll. And something really did shift. Oh, before I get into that, it just came to my mind. Y'all forgive me. Y'all know I'm a world, world about type of person. I'm just hopefully I'll come back. But I want to send out a special thank you to um, Amal CHPT and Melanie Stamoon for their videos they did for me on my last video. Um, Amal, I just want to tell you that you were spot on in everything you said. You know, if you guys if you guys wanted a shorter video on what I was trying to say on my week 35, she hit the nail on the head. You know, my highest weight of 378.8 to now 293. <laughs> I've worked, you guys. I have worked my butt off. See every single one of those pounds come off and forgive me. I worked and I'm telling y'all I won't stop working this mind is something else this subconscious this mental it's amazing what we can do to sabotage ourselves mentally or what being tired will do I didn't realize my body was really tired and last week, my body took back what it needed from me. And I, my spring break, I was in the bed sick. I was in the bed sick the whole entire week. And I don't know if I said this already. I'm sorry for repeating myself. But I needed to get this out here a day early to free myself from it. Because when I walk away from this, I'm through with it. But I wanted to be honest. 
you know, I can make a whole bunch of excuses about my gain. And you guys know I deliver my gains just like I deliver my losses. But this gain I want to talk about in depth. This gain I feel, whether it's legit or not, whether it comes off tomorrow like so many others have, I know that I need to make some more changes, some changes. I know that I've, made, I've allowed things back into my journey or try things that are new foods that need to be unintroduced. I know that. So, and then also too, I was blessed that I was able to encourage myself. Because I remember saying in week 26 when I did my New Year update, from 2011 how things had changed and how much I've been blessed to be on YouTube and be on this journey. I said a person that is a true success knows that failure is a part of this journey. Me a failure? That's a hard pill to swallow. But I don't want my next 35 weeks to be the same. I fought. I've been fighting a good fight. And like I said, I guess my body was just tired. It took back from me. I was, the last couple days I've been sleeping a lot. Um, and, um, my cycle definitely does put me wide open, so I was able to intake more. So I know that that had to be, like I said, I, I believe that this game was a legit game. And I, I'm going to own it. And I'm going to put it out here. I want you guys to understand something about Misty Lovely. I, first of all, I need y'all. I need my family. Second of all, I am an honest person. I, 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 I'm like, you know, uh... Now, granted, I think he told lies. It's been a long time since I read the story, so forgive me if I get it wrong. But George Washington, the Apple thing, I cannot tell a lie. I can't tell a lie. Um, I feel like I'm not saying a lot in this update. But I hope I'm getting my point across and saying that. Look, Misty Lovely wants more from me. I want more from myself, so... Um, I want to, as much as I can, start doing food vlogs. A lot of you guys have been asking me what I'm eating. So I want to start doing food vlogs, not only to show you guys, but to help me. I said in the beginning of my journey that I would post videos um, about my uh, exercise. And you guys just don't know how much your support means and how much that keeps me pushing. Now, as you guys see, I have incorporated weights. Um, I am doing a lot more weights now. And I won't use that as an excuse for that game, you guys. I'm not going to do that. Um, that game was a legit one because of the way that I was eating on my cycle. Um, so I have put it out here. I have freed myself. And I want to say to somebody else who is a YouTuber like myself, if you are struggling, whether you are at goal, whether you are on your way to go, put it out here. Granted, we have a few people that love to hate, but we have many more that will support. And I want to tell you guys from the depths of my soul, I love you and I appreciate every single comment, every word of encouragement, every like if you can't comment. Um, Really quickly here before I go, I want to tell some good news for you guys. Um, as you guys have saw on uh, Facebook, I have lost over 10 pant sizes. I went from a size 26 to a size 16. And I'll put the pictures at the end of this, hopefully for those of you who stayed this long. Um, I love you all. Thank you for your support. And know that Miss T. Lovely is going to ride this thing to the wheels fall off. And my subconscious battles with my mind. I am a person who is recovering from eating wrong for years. A person that would stop and quit. But the difference is knowing 
the difference and battling that and doing something about it where before I wouldn't have. So I love you guys from the depths of my soul. And I hope that this was a help and not to me first. To me first. I literally feel so much better. Um, I love you guys. Here are the pictures of Miss T. Lovely's size transformation. Love you. I'm back to play. Take a look at yourself.